Good morning, good morning, good morning. Bretto. Robotron. Every day. This is the game that we're playing. There's no controller pack. Game cannot be saved. It's all good. Hmm. Okay, Robotron 64. Licensed by Nintendo. Why is it crunchy, man? I don't like that the audio is crunchy. Huh. Yeah, okay, hold on. Hold steady. I think we're back. Can you see my controller? Yes, there you are. Okay, one player game. It's stuttering slightly. Maybe it'll be better? Alright, here we go. Player one up. Classic waves. Level one. I didn't even get to, like... Start the game. <laughs> okay, so this is a video game where you are in uh, these different, like, battle rooms and whatnot, and you have to survive them. Okay, hold on. I gotta figure out what the controls are. Hold on. Okay, so... Essentially, you are in these different rooms, and you have to defeat the robot people and save the human people. Um, and that is how this game works. I thought it was just a... Oh, okay. I thought it was just like a fun romp. Um, turns out that there actually are like some levels that you can do, obviously. Like, there are... Ooh, okay. That's not good. There we go. Okay. What am I saying? There are levels, like a progression of the game. It's not just, like, randomly generated levels. Um... Look, these, these green guys have a lot more health than the blue and red guys. It's not just, like, randomly generated levels. There are, like, actually levels. Uh, I'm starting to think that you can't kill the green guys. And you have to kill the red and blue guys without killing the green guys. Which actually makes a lot of sense. Oh. There we go. Um, so, I want to, uh, I want to beat the game, is the idea I would like to beat the game. And because this game um, is an old game, it's a port of a an arcade game. And because of that, it doesn't have very uh, player-friendly ideals, I guess. Essentially, you have three lives to beat the game, and there's, like, nothing you can do about that. Um... And so I'm going to make it uh, feasible that I beat the game. Um, and so I'm going to give myself give myself checkpoints in between levels. So I'll beat all the levels fair and square, but I, I'm not going to give myself like a life counter. I'm going to artificially take away the life counter. Wait, that kills you? What just happened? I'm gonna reload. <laughs> I'm gonna start over. I think I ran into the bomb, and the bomb is what kills you. Let me... Let me, like, lower the music, because it's... It's, like, bad. Uh, that didn't kill this guy? Excuse me? It's a twin-stick shooter game, by the way, if you couldn't tell. Is this guy gonna die? There we go. There we go. I win. My win. <laughs> It does not like the transition between levels. I will say that. <laughs> the transition between levels is not great. Um, what else did I want to say? This game has 200 levels. I'm pretty sure we're at 200 levels is the official count. Um... 
So far, as far as I can tell, you're just supposed to kill these blue and red guys. I don't see, like, anything else. Oh, maybe that thing that I just blew up at the end. <laughs> so this is why originally when I played the game, I was like, this is just, like, a, a an arcade game with, like, randomly generated levels. Because it's like all the levels are the same. <laughs> Quarks and tanks. But it turns out all the levels are not the same. Okay, now we're getting into the tanks. I'm not... I'm really not worried about, like, score. Um, I'm not going to be, like, stressing out about killing the people. Oh, the tanks are shooting. Okay. Like, I'm not worried about saving the people and getting score. I'm worried about surviving the levels. More so than anything. Do I need to kill this tank that's still around here? I guess so. Bang. Alright, there we go. Easy. And we just have to get through the stuttering in between levels. <laughs> that's all there is to it. That's not that hard, right? I hope it's still recording sound. I can't really tell. Oh. Okay, we're back. But now I know that you're not allowed to, to touch these... Um giant triangle things. And also I'm pretty sure that you're supposed to kill these... I don't know what they call them. Dart-looking guys? I don't know why I want to call them darts, though, because they're not, like, darts. <laughs> there we go. So I guess, like, the... Uh, the real difficulty... Um, like, the real difficulty seems to come from, like, you're meant to... I think the play is to, like, pick up all the people before, like, you got, like, one thing left, and then you can pick up all the people, right? To, like, maximize your score, and then you want them to, like, be alive. Because the game, the, the level ends when you kill the last enemy, right? Except for these green bozos. There you go. And then you don't get to save the people. So I guess what you want to do is, like, leave one thing alive and then, like, dodge around. And whatever. What is this? Fear the multitudes? Uh-oh. This is level 10. So we're now officially 5% of the way through the video game. Why is this level called Fear the Multitudes? I'm not really sure. I don't know what that thing is down there, and it's scary. Oh, but these, uh, these mushroom guys are back, though. And they are scary? Oh, do they make... Do they, like, put the people under mind control? And then... Because that guy looked like he was under mind control. Oh, well. I didn't die. <laughs> so that's all there is to it. As we move on. You will die. Is that what this is called? You will die. Level 11. So yeah, 200 levels. Level 200 is the final boss. Uh, what could the final boss possibly be in this game? Uh, I have no goddamn idea. But I'm sure it's uh, insane. And who doesn't love just hanging out and shooting robots for a little bit, right? It's just a, it's just a goof and a gander. It's a jolly good time. <coughs> Excuse me. Get some water here. I will smash you, man, by the way. BT dubs, I will smash you. Level 12. I would love to get through 10% um, of the game. I would love to get through 20 levels today. I don't know how feasible that is. I don't like that I can hear, like people <laughs> screaming but I'm almost at 50k points I think that's probably good I actually have no idea if that's good or not but we're gonna assume that it is what is that skull and crossbones spheroid aggression is that is that a new enemy do you think new enemy for the fans oh we have New, um, 
new cubes. I wouldn't call that spheres, per se. Oh, these guys are here. Get those out of here. Get you out of here, red guy. Sometimes it's hard for me to tell. Like, I'm, I'm so busy looking at my guy and, like, what's going on around my guy. Um, and the enemies that are directly around me that I don't, I can't, like, see the rest of the level. It's hard for me to see the rest of the world and what's going on. But as long as things aren't, like, shooting at me. Because right now, things are just, like, walking around. Maybe they start shooting. Um, but as long as they're not shooting, I'm doing, like, pretty okay, to be honest. Oh, there we go. I win. So this is, I think, where my issue came the first time I played the game. Um, where that I just save Mikey. Okay. Who's Mikey? Is I think that I was just like, I'm not like seeing any differences between this and every other, um, like every other level. So I'm like, it doesn't feel like I'm making progress per se, but I, I, I mean, I literally am making progress. <laughs> I'm assuming that, that the, the, the wiki or whatever I looked at uh, many moons ago uh, wouldn't lie to me. This game has been on the back burner for a long ass time, by the way. Um, back when, back before I started Crystal, um, I sat down and I played this game. Um... <laughs> And that was, like, recording the first episode of this game is when my, um, is when my external hard drive died. Was busted. Thank you, Remington. If you remember, he knocked it off the, uh, he knocked it off the top of my computer. <clears throat> Which was just a lovely thing for him to do. Really appreciated it. Um, so I had to, I had to re-record one episode of Crystal, um, and then, like, I just never got back around to, to recording more of this until I, I just figured I'd play Crystal, because I was enjoying it so much, and you were enjoying it so much. Thank you for enjoying it so much, by the way. Really appreciate it. If you're enjoying this, I'm going to be playing this for the next however long, until we beat 200 levels. So, if you like this, hit the subscribe button, man. I would appreciate it. Run, run, run. <laughs> Interesting level name. I guess it seems like we're going to get through 20 levels today. So maybe this is actually shorter than I thought it would be. Because it seems like... I thought that the game would get, like, really hard, and maybe it will get really hard. <coughs> So far, it has not been really hard. I'm seeing that the that those circles um, turn into the little darts, the homing missiles. So, hey, he's learning, man. You can't say I don't learn. You can't say I don't be learning. Okay, what is this? Eugene, Eugene a mean machine. That's me, man. What if my name was Eugene? Would you still like me? Would you guys still watch me if it was uh, Eugene plays games? You can be honest. I don't know if I'd watch someone named Eugene play games. That's a joke. Of course I would. I mean, if they were any good at video games. But I'm, also, I'm not good at video games. So what does that have to do with anything? Maybe nothing. Are these shoes? Do they speed me up? Oh my god, they speed me up. Except then I can't... <laughs> Aim. <laughs> <coughs> so that was the introduction of these uh, these yellow guys that just like... Oh, what is this? Meet the bees. Bonus. A bonus? I don't know anything about this game, by the way. I only know that... Like, I went into this totally, totally blind last time. Um, 
And then after I played it, I looked up how many levels there were. And saw that there were 200. And that's literally the only thing I know about this game. So... So take everything I say with a grain of salt. I don't know anything. Including that there are bonuses. <laughs> this is new information. I'm just kill I'm just I just be killing bees, man. I don't know what you do in this bonus. I don't know how you win. I don't even know if I'm getting anything. I feel like the bees are Like, regenerating every time. I don't think I'm getting less bees. Hmm. Do I have to die? Is it, like, force a death? It wouldn't force a death, right? Dang. I kind of can't believe I didn't die there. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, there I go. Alright, I'm dead. Round complete. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I only killed 38 of 98? Zilch. Zilch. At least it didn't cost me a life. I appreciate that. Alright, here we go. Aggressive waves. Wait, this is level 20. So, bon the bonus didn't count as a level? That's bogus. All right, but now we've got a different uh, we've got a different background. We've we've advanced to something new. Whoa! We have some serious slowdown, man. Boom! Gotcha! Gotcha! I see these. Do I have to kill the people? No, something is still alive. Don't die. Oh, I see it. He's up there. There he goes. Aha! <coughs> but I was I was purple. I was purple. Alright. Level 21. Enforcer Turmoil. Hmm... Holy moly, man. Look at these gold guys. Oh, more things are spawning in. Oh, frick. I can't do all this. I'm just a, I'm just a dude, man. I'm just a guy. Let me live. This is so many enemies. This is level 21? Alright. Now I can deal with the, that guy. Okay. Holy shit, man. <clears throat> that was level 21. Things are going to get intense. The whole family. Okay. It doesn't look that intense right now, but... Come on, you can do it. There we go. Just gotta be careful of the shots that, that all these tanks let out. Seems like you can shoot the shots, though. Which is huge. Like, you can shoot the shots out of midair. So that's huge for me. Um. <coughs> That does seem huge for me. Carve a path. I don't want to carve a path. I don't like that it keeps that it says player one up at the top of every single level. Like what is what is that? What does that mean, player? I'm not getting a one up at every level. Surely. Surely that's not what's happening. And don't call me Shirley. Whatever you do. Who are these? Who are these yellow men? What a, what is what is their thing? They just like walk towards me and intimidate me. 
Because if all they do is like walk towards me, I can deal with that. I can deal with bozos walking towards me. There you go. That's everyone. <clears throat> what is this? The week on Ro this week on Robotron. Was this like a TV show? Something like a TV show? They got TV shows on Robotron? Uh, I don't know why I can only think of these guys as darts. They're, they're like not darts. <laughs> no one else would think that, would see that and be like darts. I don't know why I'm like scared of the people. It's because everything else I'm like, if I touch it, it will kill, it will hurt me. Except these people that I'm supposed to be saving. <coughs> Alright. Um, <clears throat> Level 25. Here we go. Fresh brains. Fresh brains. What is that over there? Uh, okay, so I feel like I got the power up and way more... Enemy spawned? Seems like a scam. Seems like an absolute scamaz. Next time I won't touch the power up. Herd chef. Die. And then just you fall. Okay, there we go. I have eight lives. I've accumulated eight lives. That's brazy for me. Alright, well, I hope you're enjoying Robotron so far. Um, I guess we, we start, uh, we start the next segment tomorrow. See you then. Bye.